Welcome to Business Connection. I'm Liz Spencer. I'm sitting down with Yvette Saba, who's responsible for the cardiac care here at Edward Hospital. You know, we drive by Edward Hart Hospital and we just always assume it's been here forever. But really, you guys were the leader in cardiac care here in Illinois. Tell me a little bit about your proud history. When Pam Davis came to Edward, she had the vision that we would be doing cardiovascular surgery at Edward and that we were going to have a strong cardiovascular program. And so we actually began in 1990 doing cardiovascular surgery. Um, soon thereafter, we were the first in the state of Illinois to have an outpatient cardiac cath lab. And then in the early 2000s, we decided we wanted a full-blown, comprehensive heart hospital. Um, and so in the heart hospital, we eat, sleep, dream cardiovascular care, and we provide services along the entire continuum from educating our community on how to stay healthy and um, prevent cardiovascular disease to doing screenings and diagnostic testing to doing cardiac cath procedures and open heart surgery. We can pretty much do whatever you need um, in terms of care for uh, heart care. Yvette, you said that you um, eat, sleep, and drink cardiovascular care, and I thought that was a, I think that's a wonderful line. And you used the word comprehensive. What do you mean when you say comprehensive cardiac care? Providing comprehensive care here at Edward means that we can essentially do anything a patient may need in terms of um, cardiovascular services, anything a university medical uh, center can do, pretty much other than heart transplantation. We do um, cardiovascular surgery, we do electrophysiology studies, we actually are participate in a lot of research studies that pa give patients access to new things, new technologies that are available at, at University Medical Center. So we're pretty proud to say we can pretty much do it all for heart patients. Um, can you tell me a little bit, um, we've, we're hearing a lot of new um, buzzword of hybrid OR, when it, and give me a little idea what that's all about. Really what a hybrid OR is, one room that combines the capabilities of an operating room and a cardiac cath lab. So you can do open surgical procedures as well as endovascular procedures. And really the benefit of that is a completely sterile environment for endovascular procedures just in case you end up needing to open up and do an open heart procedure. So it gives you the benefit of both worlds and both surgeons and interventional cardiologists use those rooms together. And that kind of fits into that comprehensive theme of yours. Fits in the comprehensive theme and it all also um, kind of is a testament to what's really unique about Edward Hart Hospital and it's really the collaboration among our team members and that just not, doesn't mean just physicians and nurses and other clinicians, it means interdisciplinary um, members. Our cardiovascular surgeons work hand in hand with our interventional cardiologists and we actually designed the Heart Hospital that way where we have environments where the teams mix together and collaborate and make decisions about the best patient care and work together and that I think that's a unique um, differentiator that's easy to say but difficult to replicate. Next we're going to meet two doctors who are going to tell us a little bit about the unique treatment and procedures available here at Edward Hart Hospital. Here at Edward we're very lucky to see a wide range of uh, cardiology patients. Uh, we have the benefit of being able to deliver excellent standard cardiology care. In this operating room here we do all manner of adult open heart surgery. Uh, typically coronary bypass surgery, aortic valve surgery, mitral valve repair and replacement surgery, aneurysm surgery, uh, transcatheter aortic valve replacement, and destination LVAD type operations. The cath lab is where patients are brought that we do either a diagnostic evaluation, which simply means they come to the cath lab, they're given some mild sedation, and through a small tube either in their wrist or their groin, we take pictures of the artery supply and blood to the heart, which helps us define whether significant blockages that need to be fixed either with medicines, sometimes with a stent, or sometimes with bypass surgery. The newer advanced technology, technologies would include transcatheter aortic valve replacement, which we call TAVR. That's for patients who basically are either high risk or inoperable for conventional open heart surgery. It's a way we can put a valve into the heart without stopping the heart, without opening the chest. There are specific heart failure procedures here done at Edward. One is called the LVAD, that's left ventricular cyst device, which is sort of like an artificial heart. It works in conjunction with the heart, different than a heart transplant, to help the heart beat more efficiently. The really important thing is the working relationship between the doctors and the staff, and uh, I think that's something that's quite unique here. You see the cardiologists and the surgeons working uh, literally hand in glove and the medical staff as, as well. There would be 16 or 17 people in this room 
all choreographed and moving in precision synchrony together. And each one of them, it turns out, is important. Each person has a very specific job to do and has to do it at exactly the precise time to have the good results that we, we seek. What other procedures might I come in contact with at the cardiac care? Um, there's, of course, cardiac cath procedures, interventional cardiology, where we open vessels in the heart through endovascular approach. Um, we do electrophysiology procedures, we do pacemakers, we do defibrillator procedures, we also do vascular procedures. So the full complement of services. And you touched a little bit on teamwork. Is that unique to Edward? Is that one of your success stories there? I would absolutely say that our collaboration between all team members is a differentiator. When we started doing TAVR procedures, one of the requisite requirements was that the cardiologists, the cardiac surgeons, the cardiac cath lab nurses, the cardiovascular operating room nurses, all worked together. And that's a palpable feel when you come into this organization that, as I said earlier, is easy to say, difficult to replicate. Well, I like, there is a, a, a feeling of teamwork, and, and you know it when you're there, and I agree with that. Tell me what about some other exciting things that are on the horizon for you with the Heart, House, the heart Hospital here. We are always uh, with our physician partners doing new research studies, so that gives us some of the leading edge ability to partner with vendors and um, companies that make different products that gives us access to those things earlier than others. Um, to say they're absolutely going to come to fruition, you don't know because you're part of the research, but we are fortunate to be able to do that because it gives us insight into the future. Tell me a little bit about the patient experience here. Sure. When a patient comes to the hospital um, and has a procedure done, um, as I mentioned earlier, we have a dedicated cardiovascular team from the beginning of the process to the end. And once the patient has a procedure or is just in, uh, admitted to an inpatient unit, we have dedicated cardiovascular nurses caring for them. Like I said, we eat, sleep, and uh, dream about cardiovascular care. And really, that's led to the quality outcomes that we have here. We have mm -hmm. dedicated providers, dedicated nurses that have been specially trained in cardiovascular disease. And as a result, we've earned many accolades because of the outcomes that we've gotten. Um, health grades 10 years in a row, top 10% cardiovascular care, um, top uh, 100 heart hospital, American Heart Association Get With The Guidelines awards. So we're being recognized for the care that we've delivered with our specially trained teams. Well, I think it's exciting that Naperville has Edward Heart Hospital here. It, you know. 10 years ago, 20 years ago, it was a really big deal to have a heart problem. And now it still is, but you're in such good hands that, that the stress that comes with that goes down because we get to come here to the Edward Heart Hospital. Yvette, thanks for stopping by and telling me a little bit about what you do and the great work here at Edward Hospital. Thank you for having me. We'll be right back with more Business Connection.